What's up, what's up, everyone? Good afternoon. How's everybody doing today so far? It's not even noon over here yet, and we're already, we're already here. What's up, John? What's up, the biz guy? Bad references. <laughs> hey, man. <laughs> it's a great day in Texas, sounds like. Where's everybody from right now? We got people from everywhere, hopefully. What's up, Josh Beaton? We got someone from Israel. Uh... Yo, <laughs> Michigan, Missouri. Oh boy, a quickie. I'm going to start calling these marketing quickies because I, I just want to go fast. Guppy is back. Baltimore's in the house. Colorado, Belgium. Someone from Boise, Jamaica, Missouri, Lehigh, Pennsylvania. Boca Raton. Tom Bill's in the house. What's up, my man? Um, <laughs> New Mexico, Vegas, Ireland, California. <laughs> from Mars, someone's here from Mars. We got Astro, we got Atlanta, we got Utah. Let's start this crap, says Whoopi. I can't swear on TV, right? Texas. All right, all right. You guys ready for this? I don't want to take too much of your time because I got to get back to work. You got to get back to work. Um, but we're going to do a marketing quickie and just have some fun. So um, if you guys are excited, before we get into it, I need a double tap. I need some hearts. I need some hearts to get me pumped up. Otherwise, my energy level is going to be low. If you guys get me excited, it's going to be way better, I promise you. So give me double tap or triple tap. And remember, just smacking three fingers, it doesn't work. you got to put in the effort, put in the work, and just start just start clicking like crazy. And then we'll see the hearts flowing, and I'll have the energy we need. <laughs> All right, guys. And we're at 99 people. 98, someone left. 99, so we get 100, I can go. One more person, one more person, we can go. And some more hearts. We're going to be stuck at 99 and just never get a talk. Oh, Jonathan triple trap and clicked out. All right, we hit 100 people. Boom, we can go. Okay. Um, first off, you guys, it's on my Donkey Kong. Um, I'm ready for this. Are you guys ready? All right, so this is the game plan. Um, I want to talk about something that drives me freaking crazy. People all the time come to me and they're like, um, they're trying to sell something, right? They want to make some money and uh, they get on and they're like, Russell, I'm going to... I'm going to make an automated webinar and I'm going to record it. That way I don't have to give the actual webinar. It'll be awesome. That way I can sit at home in my underwear and I don't have to sell anything and I can make money. Okay? Now, obviously, that is a beautiful dream and it someday will come true for some of you guys, maybe. Um, I've got auto webinars that do work that make me money. So that, that concept works. But what I want to stress is that you got to just freaking get good at selling and you got to sell a lot. Okay? For example, check it right here. This right here is my Funnel Hacks webinar. Um, I just made eight tweaks to it from the webinar I did last night. So last night I did it live. I'm doing it live again in about uh, 20 minutes. I'll be on live again. Um, and guess what? I keep changing it and keep tweaking. Guess how many times you think I've done this thing live? Okay, and this is from Russell who, uh, who was one of the initial inventors. In fact, we had a software called Live Webinar Replay which was the first commercial webinar replay service on earth. So um, I'm a big uh, fan of auto webinars, click funnels and auto webinars. But even with that, guess what? I'm doing it live again. I've done it live, I would say, conservatively speaking, at least 40, maybe even 50 different times. Okay, so Russell, why do you do it live every single time? Because every time I do it live, a couple things happen. First off, I get better. I've got to get better. My skills need to get better. Your skills need to get better. If you do an auto webinar once and you put it out there, you don't get any better. Okay, that's number one. You've got to get good. Sharpening the saw, you're right. Bad references. You gotta sharpen the saw. Every time I do a webinar, I get better and better and better. Right now, we consistently close 15% every single time, like clockwork. Every single time. I can watch and see how many people are on the webinar. I know exactly how much money I'm gonna make consistently. It's because I've done it over and over and over and over and over again, okay? Because I didn't take the shortcut. I didn't wuss out. I didn't say, oh, I'm not gonna sell today. I freaking got on there and just sold. And I keep doing it. Now, every time I do the webinar, guess what happens? I learned some stuff. First time I did it, I did it live in an event. And, uh, and I did really, really well. We closed 38% of the room, which was great for me. People were running to the back. Next morning, I'm about to jump on my plane, and some lady's like, hey, your presentation was awesome, but the problem is I don't have a supplement company, so it doesn't work for me. And I'm like, wait, what? Like, this doesn't just work for supplement companies. It works for anyone. She's like, really? I'm like, well, what do you do? She's like, I'm a coach. I'm like, this works for coaches, too. Like, if you're a coach, this works perfectly. She's like, I didn't even know. And so she ran over, and she bought it real quick. Okay, and then she told me three of her friends didn't buy it because that's so when they went all bought. And I was like, okay, my presentation obviously makes people think they have to have supplements for this to work. Let me change my slides a little bit. And I added four slides in there. The next, uh, three days later, I did my very first webinar webinar to one of my friends' email list. Um, we had a, a lot of people on. I did the webinar and I think we closed, it was like thirty or $40,000 in sales, which was, our, which was good, right? But not great. 
And so we sold it, and I had another webinar happening four hours later with less people, but um, but it was happening four hours. I'm like, okay, well, what could I improve on? So I went through and I exported all of the questions that everybody had asked during the webinar. I read them all, and I'm like, holy crap, people are so confused about this part and this part and this part. Went back to my slides, tweaked it, changed it, added a whole bunch of things in there. Four hours later, did the exact same webinar to our smaller group. Instead of closing $30,000 in sales, we did $120,000 in sales. Okay? Now you think, okay, I got this thing perfect. Now Russell's going to automate it. Heck no, I did it. After that webinar was done, I exported all the questions. I looked at them all again. I saw people got stuck. Saw what the questions were. Rebuild the PowerPoint slides again. Then guess what? Did the webinar the next day. Boom, 150 grand. And I did it again. I did it again. And we built an eight-figure business within eight months by doing the webinar live over and over and over and over and over again. Okay, I did the webinar last night live. Today, I exported the questions. I changed my slides. I'm doing it live again here in T-minus 18 minutes with the updates, okay? Why do I keep doing this? Because it keeps getting better and better and better, okay? Hopefully this is motivation to you guys. You gotta work hard. If you wanna make a lot of money, if you wanna change people's lives, you wanna grow a company, you gotta work hard. If you guys agree with me, give me a double tap or triple tap, okay? Yes, the biz guy said he wants to break 100,000 hearts. If 100,000 hearts, you gotta do like five taps, like five fingers going nuts like crazy. Okay, so you guys gotta start selling. Okay, business is about one thing, making offers to people. Okay, and what's cool about it is you start making offers and sometimes people are gonna be like, huh, and they're not gonna buy. And you're gonna find out, wow, that offer sucked. Nobody wants it, so let me make a new offer. And you make a new offer and the second time, guess what? It sucks again. You're like, oh, okay, people don't want that. What else can I do? And you make a new offer and a new offer and you keep doing it over until eventually you get one that works. And then when it works, you make it better and 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 eventually, you've got something amazing, okay? All right. And uh, as I can't pronounce your name, Satoshio said, webinars raise your profile in, as an industry of experts. Yeah, so I don't care if you're doing webinars or whatever you're doing, but you guys, you, you've got to be, you, you, we're in the business of selling stuff, okay? If you're not, <laughs> Brad said he was listening, he was conquer your niche back in the day. Um, if you're not selling stuff, you're not going to make any money. Okay, and if you're really bad at selling stuff, you got two options. One is hire a salesperson for you. Or number two, start working hard. Start learning how to sell. Sell over and over and over again. If you watched videos from me 10 years ago, how many of you guys have ever seen a video from me 10 years ago? This was me. This is me, all nervous, shaved head. Hi, I, I'm, I'm Russell, and um, I've got to yeah, I was scared to death. Guess how I got good at it? I did it over and over and over and over and over and over and over again for the last 10 years. How do you think, I could do this webinar in my sleep. I don't even need slides, I can close my eyes and do the whole webinar because I've done it so many times. But yes, again, I'm doing it live again because I need to make it better. I gotta figure out the new tweaks, new ways to do it, okay? And so for those of you guys who are like, I suck I suck at selling, it's because you're not selling enough. I suck on videos because you haven't done enough videos. I suck at webinars, you haven't done enough webinars. Like, how many webinars have you done this week? If the answer is less than one, if it's less than two or three, like, that's your problem. You're not making enough offers. Not enough people are seeing what you're selling. So go and do it. What's the best book to learn how to sell? There's no book to learn how to sell. Just go sell. Okay? Like, that's it. Um, if you want to learn how to sell on the webinar, go to perfectwebinarsecrets.com. Um, it's uh, $4.95. I'll ship you out my webinar script. It'll, it's the webinar script we built an eight-figure business off of. It's amazing. You can plug in any product, any service, uh, and I walk through how to sell on that. Like, that's going to be your best thing. It's less than five bucks. Perfectwebinarsecrets.com. Get that. That's all you need to learn how to sell. And then you got to go out there and just sell, okay? I remember a while ago, it's probably like five or six years ago, I was in this, this mastermind group, and this guy was trying to figure out how to generate more leads. And he's like, yeah, like I wrote an, I wrote an article and not getting leads. I'm like, oh, well, how many articles this, uh, how many articles did you submit this week? And he's like, this week? And I'm like, yeah. He's like, oh, we've written one article. I'm like, dude, that's the problem. you got to do a lot of it. If you want to be successful, like it's a lot of consistent effort. It's not like one thing every once in a while, okay? And so that's it, you guys. If you want to dominate and succeed, you got to sell and sell and sell. Even if nobody shows up, do a Periscope. If nobody's on, I don't care. Just sell something. Do a webinar. If nobody shows up, like that's all fine. Like It's going to teach you how to sell. Um, one of my buddies, Anthony, he was trying to do his very first webinar. He promoted on Facebook, got some registrants. He showed, oh, thanks. Focus said, dot-com secrets book was scary good. Uh, anyway, he, he, gets on, he gets on the very first webinar um, and uh, one dude shows up and he's like, screw it, I gotta learn this anyway. And he did a two hour long webinar with one dude. Now the worst thing is about 90 minutes in, that one dude disappeared and do you think he stopped? Heck no, he kept doing it, why? 
He's trying to learn how to sell. Like that's way more important than you actually selling. Learning how to sell will serve you way more than actually selling. Because if you learn how to sell, you'll be able to sell. So do a webinar, even nobody shows up, pretend like there's a million people and just do it over and over and over and over and over again. Okay, it's not as much fun, but it'll work. All right, what's up, Damien? How's it going, my man? All right, guys, well, I gotta go. My webinar's starting in 13 minutes, but I need some more hearts. If we're gonna, if we're gonna do, keep doing this every day, I need some more hearts. So if you guys are having fun right now, get a double tap. If you learned something new or got exp- excited or motivated, give me a triple tap. And if you, yes, by the way, Sage, it's the exact same webinar, exact same thing, over and over and over and over again. Sean's ready for webinar time. Appreciate you too, Thomas. You're awesome. By the way, got your gift, man. I, I didn't thank you, but thank you. That was awesome. Um, all right, cool. Um, all right, now one last thing. If you guys want to see any of the past Periscopes, um, all you got to do is go to blog.dotcomsecrets.com. So blog.dotcomsecrets.com. And you can see all my old Periscopes, blog posts, Mark Me Your Car podcast, all my cool stuff's there for free. You guys will love it. Appreciate you all. Um, say goodbye with the triple tap. Thanks, everybody. Have an awesome day. Go sell something. By tomorrow when we do this Periscope, if you guys haven't sold something, I- I'm going to be kicking your butts. That's it. <laughs> all right. Love you guys, too. Thanks, everybody. Have an awesome day. And I will talk to you guys all again soon. See you, everybody. Bye. I don't want to stop. The hearts are still coming. <laughs> I hate stopping these things because it's so much fun. All right. I, got, I really got to go. The webinar. <laughs> the webinar. Sorry. I got to go, guys. Bye, everybody.